<laughs> a tarantula has been discovered in a supercontinent could wipe out humans. Eh, we had a good run. Cody is here to slap us with sight. We had okay. a good run, John. It was fine. A All merciful right, for, ending. <laughs> first story. The British Museum is asking for the public's help in recovering around 2,000 stolen artifacts. The museum announced that the thefts uh, announced that the thefts occurred after it was discovered some objects were reportedly being sold online. Oh. Officers, uh, officials say they've started a hotline for people who think they may have some of the missing items, and another hotline for people that are related to those people that won't admit it. <laughs> uh, Sixty artifacts have been returned, and a few hundred others are expected to be brought back soon. The museum says most of the missing items are Greek and Roman gems and some jewelry. Oh, interesting. Have they thought about contacting Harrison Ford? <laughs> Good point. Excellent point. You bet. It's like, what's that? that the whole Indiana Jones? Uh, yeah, basically. Okay. Yeah. A researcher has discovered an electric blue species of tarantulas. Oh, okay. They're from, ah! the, they're from the 80s. Ah, the spider was found living in a mangrove forest in southern Thailand. Uh, scientists say the electric blue coloring comes from the unique structure of their hair. Right. Yeah. Uh, the spider's color varies by sex and age. Females and young males have more violet no. hairs than metallic blue on parts of their body. No. Uh, the electric blue tarantula is apparently one of the world's rarest Tra tarantulas. Well, I guess since we just discovered it. Look at that. <laughs> Man, that's cool. They spent a lot of money making that Blue Beetle movie. She just got a blue tarantula. Be done with it. All right, back to the science. Well, the formation of a new supercontinent could wipe out humans and make Earth uninhabitable for 200 and 250 million years. It's got to hang on a little more. Set your clocks. <laughs> British researchers used supercomputer super models to predict how the climate extremes would intensify after the world's continents merged into one called Pangaea Ultima. Cool name, but I want to be there. They found out it would be extremely hot, dry, and virtually uninhabitable for humans and mammals. That's a problem. The last mass extinction occurred 60 million, 66 million years ago when an asteroid slammed into Earth and killed off the dinosaurs and most of the life on the planet. So we got something to look forward to, John. So we're due. <laughs> we're due. Human <laughs> slap was on. Ugh. Still not feeling 100% from yesterday. Just doing this, Ugh. it's too much. Back to you, John. First time I filled in for you on that, mm -hmm. I got real aggressive with my, and then realized how winded I was when I had to read the rest of the story. <laughs> I was like, oh, you got to. It's not so easy, is it, John? Yeah, yeah. Being me. Hmm.